what is up so in today's video I am going to be creating this look for you guys it is very festive it is very dark but it does have a shimmer to it and I really like how it came out actually I was playing around a little bit with makeup as you guys know in the last video that I did post I did have weight loss surgery I had the vertical sleeve gastrectomy I have received some messages from you guys which I do appreciate I will get back to you whenever I go online again but today I wanted to put up this video for you guys because New Year's Eve is literally tomorrow. Tomorrow is the 31st and wow this year flew by really quick. And I know there's a whole bunch of controversy on this year. A lot of people have died and it's just crazy at the moment but I am actually very grateful to this year. My family and I have accomplished a lot and whatever happened throughout this year I just know that for me 2016 was not a bad year at all so now that we stepped away from that you guys will notice that in this video I'm pretty like in the beginning I'm pretty down or I'm pretty chill and that is because once again I am only just four days post off it hasn't even been a week so I'm still getting accustomed to everything I'm still super sore my throat is still super swollen there's just a lot of things that I have to get accustomed to but other than that of course I love you guys very much so I wanted to post this video for you guys and I hope that you really do appreciate and enjoy this look. I don't think I have anything else to say for now other than I love you guys and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Mm. Bye! So let's get ready to see this transformation. Of course, I'm going to be priming my eyes to avoid any creasing throughout the night. And this whole look is going to be from the TARDIS Pro palette. Look at that bad boy. First color that I'm going to be picking up is Bold. I'm going to be applying this all over my crease up until my brow bone and I'm going to be blending this out until it reaches this color. I'm going to begin to grab the color Edgy now. I'm going to be doing the same thing except I'm focusing this just on the outer V of my eye. Grabbing one of the two of the stars of the show. This is the color, I don't know, I, I didn't see it, but I pointed it out. <laughs> I'm applying this just on the outer V, making sure that this has a winged effect to it. I didn't pick up a lot of product on the brush, and when I'm blending this out, I'm not using a lot of pressure on the brush neither. So I'm just going to be grabbing some concealer and a used concealer brush and I'm going to be applying this all over my lid. So here I'm grabbing the star of the show which is called Trendy. I'm applying this with a flat tone brush all over the lid or basically where I applied the concealer. Here I'm just using whatever is already left on the brush and I am cleaning up the edges a little bit because I was pretty harsh when I was applying the lid color and here I'm just making everything blend out together seamlessly. Same thing here, I'm not grabbing anything on the brush, I am just blending everything out together. Grabbing the color Glam now, I am going to be applying this right in the center of my lid just to spice things up a little bit. So this is how your eyes should look. Moving on to curling on my lashes, I'm going to be curling them with my Tarte Eyelash Curler for approximately 15 seconds each. And then after, I'm going to be applying my Estee Lauder Sumptuous Extreme Mascara. I decided to go for some really natural eyelashes today, not too extreme. If you guys are interested, I do have a foundation routine which I will link down below. Face is done, so I'm finishing off the eyes. I'm going to be adding some smudge proof black eyeliner. Once again, I'm going to be grabbing the color Glam and I'm going to be applying this from the middle of my eye all the way into the inner corner. And then of course I had to touch up a little bit and add it a little bit more to my lid. Grabbing the color Trendy now, I'm going to be focusing this right on the outer edge of my eyes.
I'm finishing off the eyes, I'm just going to be adding some Estee Lauder Sunshine's Extreme Mascara to my lower lashes. I decided to go for my perfect nude as I like to call it, so I am going to be outlining my lips. I'm not going to be overlining today, just outlining my natural lip shape with my lip liner in Jordana. I'm also going to be grabbing the color Love Life by the Sephora Rouge collection and using Smashbox Gloss in the color Jewelry. And this completes my entire New Year's Eve look for the year 2016. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.